I have three uncles and I just listened to um, one of my relatives talk about his dad who's a brother to my dad. Um, my dad is Isaac Belgard, um, a blue sky man. And his brother, Charlie Belgard, and then the, the other brother is um, Johnny Belgard. And this would have been, all three of them, they would have learned this from their mother, Josephine Demarest Belgard, who's my grandmother, my paternal grandmother. They lived the life that in order to make money, there's two ways. You earn it yourself and you keep it. And so that's something that my grandmother, she was um, um, Josephine, she was a midwife at home and she raised eight children by herself in, in the early 20s, 30s and 40s. And she did it on land and uh, she fought for everything that um, she wanted for her children and her family. It's really sad, you know, that she had to do that. But I think about her humble beginnings and how she uh, learned from the land, you know, f learned about the medicines and she also brought children into this world, babies, and she helped a lot of families. And in that way, she would get, you know, they would give her a cow or they would give her pigs or chickens or whatever they had. So uh, she had a lot of ingenuity, you know, to do a lot of things. And she walked to wherever she wanted to go. And so I think that that is just, uh, you know, when you look at the Native contributions, there's so many. I mean, I don't think there's books that are written on it. And, um, you know, from pharmaceutical standpoint, we have medicines for um, cancer, diabetes, stroke, um, the West Nile virus. Um, just about anything and everything we have, those medicines are our, our, our uh, earth mother, you know, our backyard provides that all to us. And so I, I often tell people that I work with when I talk with them about the medicines, I always tell them, you know, these medicines are gonna, going to touch you. You have to learn how to harvest them, when to collect them and how to work with them and they'll give your spirit, their spirit to you to help you. But that's something that you have to work with. And that's the same thing that I learned, you know, from my mother and my father and my grandfather before me, is that uh, if there's something that you want, then you need to work, work for that because things aren't going to come to you. So, you know, and this thing about education today, you know, um, I know that's been talked about, but that we need to use what is given to us today, you know, to help our people, you know, to become, um, to be able to uh, walk, you know, that good road of our ancestors that our ancestors walked. <laughs>